All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get BL Heli 32 to run on a Mac. It's not very hard. It does take a little bit of time. So first, you're going to want to get this program. There's a lot of virtual programs out there, and I'm just going to use VirtualBox because I've got this one running, and I found it very easy. I'll put the links below. So VirtualBox, that's what you want to do. Download VirtualBox 6.0. Again, I'm using a Mac. So package, it's an OS. We're going to download this wherever you want to put it and then what you're also going to need to download you might as well start now is you go here to Windows and you can actually download Windows 10 disk image so kind of like the Windows 10 uh, to your computer so you come here I'll put this link in the description below as well um, blah 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 select edition Windows 10 confirm and then what language you want English confirm um, I'll do the 64-bit why not right and it's gonna there it is and you hit save now this is a, a large file it looks like it's 4.7 gigabytes so I've already downloaded this before so I'm not going to clog up my internet I'm just going to stop that okay so once you've got these downloaded Gonna go to VirtualBox Show and Finder now. It'll automatically show you where it is. We're gonna open it, and this is what you're gonna to use to run Windows inside. And here you're just going to follow the directions. I sped this up. It's click here, click here, click here, and then it's done. Come over here to Applications should have VirtualBox. Open that. So now we're here, we're going to click New. Name, let's just make it simple. Windows 10. Why not, right? We'll leave that the same. We're going to use Windows 10, and this is where you select which version. We download the 64 or 32-bit. Like I said, we downloaded it to 64, so we're going to leave it there. We're going to select Continue. And now, select the amount of memory here. I'm just going to leave it the default because that's what it recommended. Hit continue. Here you can create a virtual hard disk in the machine. Well, yeah, I better do create a virtual one. Hit create. And then here, the virtual box, just use it like that. Hit continue. Leave that. Windows 10. That looks good there. I'm going to bring this down to 25. I'm not really putting too much on here. Create. Save. Go up to here. We're going to, go to display. Okay, so now we're here. Now we're going to go down here and click start. But now it says we don't see anything. So we need to go get that file that we downloaded from you probably have it a lot sooner but this uh, this file right here is Win10 the Windows file that you downloaded we're going to open that and we hit start and then we go hit next install now I don't have a product key. Windows 10 Home. I accept. And we gotta use this one. And then we're gonna do this drive O. Hit next. Here is just Windows installing. I didn't do anything fancy, just the defaults. If I did it did not need it enabled. I didn't have it enabled. And I just fast forwarded it all for you. All right, so now that we got Windows on here, we need to get PO Heli 32. So open this little E. And in the search bar, type in BL Heli 32 Suite. 
and then you want to go to this WordPress link and then we want to go to this one right oops download BL Heli Suite and then what we're going to look for here right here remember we want BL Heli 32 Suite so we can click this download What do, you, what do you want to do with that? We're going to save it. It's done downloading, so we're going to open it. Okay, so there's where it went. Downloads, BioHeli32. You can open that. Uh, extract all. So I've got to extract all. That's where we're going to put it. I forgot it was, it was zip, so we have to extract it. Okay, so there, that's what it is. Downloads, BL Heli 32, and that's where it's at. Now I'm going to do this. I'm going to do create shortcut so it's easy to find it. There's my little shortcut. Click it once. I'm going to drag it out and put it on the desktop. And remember, this is on your Windows desktop. Okay, so now I can close this. Close this. Remember, everything runs slow because it's, you know, you're running two operating systems. Close this. Close this. Uh, close this. All right. Now, double click this. Boom. There it is. All right. So I've got a beta flight board here plugged in. And what you notice is I plugged it in and didn't make that little ding ding sound. So we have to get that to work. So what you do is you go back here and go to settings. I think it's ports, USB. And then you click this little add. And here, this is, I've actually got a tiny hawk. But uh, it would, if you did the BL Heli 30 pass through, it's going to say like NAS 32 board. You just click that and on there and then OK. And then come back here. So just disconnect it and then plug it back in. It's setting that up. And then you should see this here USB serial device connect. And that's going to connect it to it. And you would hit read setup. And you would do all this. I don't have a BL Heli 32 ESC with me. So, but that's all you need to do. Change it, save it. And then when you're done, disconnect. And so you're all done with, you know, using your BL 32. Come over here to the little windows right here. And then shut down. That's how you shut, shut the system down and close it. But that's all. I hope that helps you uh, get BL Heli 32 on your Mac. And... Not too scary. Thank you.